Hey everyone, welcome back to RGB Tech. So today, we're taking a look at a really useful tool called AIHumanize.com. If you've ever worked with AI-generated text, whether it's for SEO content, essays, or articles, you've probably noticed it can sound a little robotic sometimes. That's where AIHumanize.com comes in. It helps refine that text, making it sound natural and human-like. If you're into creating better, more polished content, you're going to find this tool super handy. And trust me, you're going to love this AI humanizer. It's super easy to find. Just simply search for it on web, or you can directly use the link in description to access this page. Now, just click on Login and sign up with your Google account. After that, you'll get some free credits. All right. So, here you need to enter the text. This web tool uses the Falcon AI model, which seamlessly bypasses most AI detection systems. And here you can change, I mean, you can rewrite the text in your writing style or in your language, which sounds more human-like. And here you can paste the text script, or you can upload the document file like the Word or text documents. So simply I'll ask ChatGPT to generate a short essay about AI. Copy the text and paste it here. So here the model is already selected to Falcon 2.0. Now check for AI. It starts to analyze. All right, so here it shows that 56% of this text appears human-like, while there is a 44% probability that it is generated by AI. It also presents the text analysis metrics as perplexity, length normality, in-length variation, and sentence length. Here, perplexity is a measure of how unpredictable a text is, aiming to confuse or perplex the average reader. Sentence length indicates the average number of words. And here are the perplexities in the text, like it highlighted some of the words. Now same if we try to check this text in GPT-0, so simply, I'll paste it in here, scan. And it's highly confident that this text was AI-generated. Now let's do check it on Originality AI. Like you know, this tool is designed to detect AI-generated content, helping users identify text produced by AI models like GPT-3.5 and GPT-4, and it's 100% confident that its AI script highlighted words in red, and same, let's do check on the Zero GPT. Well, Probably, yes. It shows that almost 93% of this text is AI-generated. Now what I do now is simply click on Humanize. Now this AI-generated text will become human-like script. All right, it's done. Now I'll simply copy this text. Let's check it on GPT-0. Paste it here. Scan. So, as you can see, there's over a 10% probability that it is AI-generated text, and almost 90% sounds more human-like. That's actually a pretty good score. Let's also check it out on Originality AI. All right, I'll paste it here. Now scan. Okay, so, we got a 100% score, and it's confident this content was created by a human. And same again if we check it out on 0GPT. Let's detect the text. Yep, it's human written. Now, like in the same way, I'll ask ChatGPT to generate a short email. Like many people use AI to send mails, whether for business or personal communication. Like, honestly, they sound even more like robotic. Simply, I'll copy and paste the text in here. Now check for AI. Like, guys, oh my god, look at it. Almost 93% of the text is AI generated. Let's humanize this mail. All right, it's humanized. Now let's check for AI like only 4% sounds only AI. Almost sound more human and confident. Now let's humanize it again for the 0% AI result. Okay? Check for AI. Now this time only 1%, like almost 99% is human-like. Now I will copy this text. Let's check out in GPT-0. Now again, scan. Like almost 71% of the text is human, it's considered. Also, on the originality AI, it shows 93% of score, means the text sound more human, and on zero GPT, 
it shows 0%, means it passed all the cases to be honest. So AI Humanizer is a powerful tool that makes AI-generated text sound more natural and human. It's super easy to use and perfect for anyone looking to improve their writing. Be sure to check it out through the link in the description. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the bell for more. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.